Mini Wargamer Dave here from MiniWargamer.com. Welcome, Wargamers, to a special series of videos, we'll call this, because I'll do more than one of these. And in this video series, I'm going to be building my new Warhammer Fantasy army. I'm collecting Warriors of Chaos. The army that I should have been collecting for many a year. So, without further ado, let us turn the camera around and look at the models that I have so far. Yeah, you can already see them behind me on the table, but we're going to get a bit of a close-up look at these guys. First off, I need to just say that the Warriors of Chaos are ridiculously awesome. As for how many points I have here, I'm not exactly sure. I haven't calculated them yet. I know that I'm able to build an army more than 2,000 points. I can tell you that much. So I have at least 2,000. I think I have about 2,500 points. That would be my guess. I have a corn lord. That's how he's decked out right now. He's got the axe of corn. And I have this guy right here. Who can tell me what this is? Is he a sorcerer of Nurgle? That's what I hope he is. Uh, I have a squad of chosen over here on this side. Quote, chosen are sick in this game. I've reviewed some of their stats and they just look awesome. Over here on this side, some core choices. I have some warhounds. Two squads of them. Then I have some warriors of chaos. These warriors of chaos I've actually painted up. These are the only ones that I've painted up so far. These warriors of chaos over here I got from Jordan. He sold me his army. And so everything that you see that's painted red in this army was once his. Everything that you see that is painted in this new color scheme are models that I've painted. With the help of my kit says Mel. And we have a couple more Warriors of Chaos squads. Actual warriors behind there. So, <clears throat> pretty cool. Now, here in the middle, we have two squads of Marauders. Two squads, two units of Marauders. Um, I got 80 Marauders there. I just wanted to get a lot of Marauders because I heard that they are just sick, especially with flails. Apparently, that gives them plus two to their first round of combat, plus two to strength, and uh, they do some pretty sick damage with that. With the Mark of Corn, giving them an extra attack, I think that would be pretty sweet. I'll have to see how it plays out in battle, but from the sounds of it, it doesn't matter how cheap they are, they'll do some devastation before they're killed, if they're killed. Then I have this giant back there, that was also Jordan's, he's given it to me. I fielded him a couple times so far, one time he did nothing, the other time he killed a Hydra, that was pretty fun, so he seems to be a, a hit or miss type of unit. And we have three Chaos Knights back there. That first squad was once Jordan's. You'll have to excuse that guy on the very left. He's sleeping. And the horse's head is also doing a Godfather thing. Other than that, that's my first squad of painted Chaos Knights. Working on the second squad there, I just finished up the bones, the skulls, the horns. Going to be working on the rest. Then we have another primed squad back there. So all in all, this is my Chaos Army. If there's anything else you think I should add to this army, please leave a comment in the comments below. What needs to be included in a Chaos Army? How does this army look for starters? Is it a good looking army? Am I on the right track? I am completely new to this. I have the codex, I've been reading through many different parts, I want to build up my army as fast as possible so that I can play more games because it's a lot of fun, I have to admit. The couple games that I've played so far are a lot of fun. Also, if you have not gotten into Warhammer Fantasy, this is a video that will help you get into that because um, you can just start it with me because essentially that's what we're doing here. I'm brand new to this and you can be too. 
So, and don't look at this and think, oh, well, I can't get a 3,000 point army like you. Don't think of it that way. Think of it as he's also starting and I can start too. I'll start with one or two squads or a battalion or whatever. Just start, just get into it. I, I only started with a couple squads. I just started, I just happened to uh, film it now. So it's actually been about a month in the making here. I guess it looks like a good amount of models done for a month. But that's not working on it full time for a month. That's uh, working on it as much as I can uh, at nighttime after the kids go to sleep. Month. I'm so excited to feel stuff in this game. I can't believe how much fun it is. It's ridiculous. The magic is fun. The abilities are fun. The thing that I like is that you can bring the same squad and you can completely deck them out with different war gear and it makes them a, a different squad. And like, I can have two different squads of um, marauders, and this one has the mark of corn with flails, and this one has the mark of zinch with shields. And so they, they would be totally different squads. Same with these guys, same with the warriors. Totally different, different purposes. And that's why I find it fun, is because I have a lot of control over what I bring in my army. A whole new world has opened up to me. Just thinking of the possibilities. So, in my battle reports, you won't see any unpainted models. In fact, you won't even see any half painted models. Like these Marauders, they're not ready. They're not battle report worthy yet. These Warriors are. They're ready. These guys are not. Even these Chosen are not yet. They're not ready for battle reports. Not quite. My next goal is to get all of these done, these 80 Marauders. I want to get these guys done so that I can just field large blocks of guys and scare people because I've been told that they are an awesome core choice. So leave a comment, let me know what I should add to the army. Let me know if you are starting Warhammer 40k and what armies you're collecting and what you plan on getting first and if this video at all helps you get into it. If you've been thinking about it and you haven't done it yet, use this video as an excuse. Think to yourself, I'm going to start along with Dave and we're gonna have awesome fun together. I was gonna say we're gonna have awesome together, but yes, yeah, we'll go with that. We're gonna have awesome together. Thank you very much for watching this video and happy war gaming. I need a haircut.